Hey guys, what's up? This is the app dude back with you again with another app review coming your way. And uh, you're going to be reviewing Stick Wars 99 cents in the app store. They just updated it, but they said um, that would be better if we did not update it because there is a bug when you try and load the game. So um, I'm bringing you version 1.3 in the app store. Version 1.4 will include new features and uh, all that good stuff. But um, here we go, guys. Uh, down the bottom, it gives you the help, a long section on how to um, play the game, and under options, we have the amount of blood. You can change that. The game difficulty, the shake to deploy bomber that's enabled, sound effects you can enable that, background music, and rotate screen 180. Okay, guys, and under high scores, um, takes you online, and you can see some crazy, ridiculous high scores. But we don't have time for that. So, um, I went ahead and played to round 20 for you guys, so I could show you some of the features that you don't get until the later round. So, you can choose load game or new game. We're just going to click load game. As you heard, there was sound effects at the beginning, but we're not going to play that right now. Um, so here we go, guys. This is after a round, round 20, and I have $9,943. And, um, up here you can repair your walls. This is my HP, 560 out of, uh, 1100. And when it's filled up, it's when it's filled up all the way to 1100. Obviously, your wall right there is um, filled up. So I'm going to show that guys to in a second. So we're just going to repair our walls here. And um, once that's filled up all the way, you can fortify. And what fortify does is it adds more health. So that I could do a thousand HP. That'll bring in 21 HP, so it has even more protection. But I'm just going to do a couple 100s here. And we'll do three. I think that's good. So four, eh, we'll do 1,500. So there we go. And you can click next level, help. And you can choose your option to reduce troops, which will be helpful later on when you're running out of money. Okay, guys. So here we go. Um, I got uh, six archers over here. And here is the guy, the stick guys running around. This is why it's called Stick Wars. And they're trying to get to your castle over here. And this is your wall to protect it. And uh, on that left right here is a prison. And you can hold um, these guys captured, actually. And um, you can create prisoners and everything, which is a very nice feature. And as you see, there's, like, horses and everything running at me. Right now, I only have one prison slot because I am, um, I just got the prison. But these guys are coming running at you with swords and all this crap, and you need protection. And if I press that bomb button in the bottom right-hand corner, I can, well, I'll show you guys. I release that, and boom, he blows up. So the prisoner, that I only had one prisoner at the time, but he um went out and destroyed that uh that guy right there. And that's the only way you can kill the brown wagons or whatever um, is by that. And um so at the end of the round, it shows you... um. A general overview it shows you the kills, gravity, archers, explosion, all that, how much my upkeep was, which was for the six archers, $600 upkeep, so my new cash balance is $10,009. Um, so we click continue, and uh, here we are, guys. I lost a little bit of health, but that's not too bad. And over here is a prison, which is $5,000. It's where you put the captives in. It's where you put the uh, enemies in, and you can hold them captive, and you can use them for bombs, archers, uh, repairmen, or for a wizard. So we're going to click Alright, we need to click help. But, um, oh, I did click next level. So there's my archers over there. And they're going to shoot down uh, the guys that come in. See, I didn't even have to move them. But your main goal is you, you just want to touch below the prisoner, or, or below the enemy, and then flick upwards, and they'll go high flying in the sky. So, pretty sweet, guys. We just released a um, prisoner. There we go. He blew up. And, um... So if you want to get more archers, you just have to double tap the little tin over there that says a six next to it. Um, but I don't want any more right now. I find the archers don't do a whole lot of good unless you have like tons of them. And my HP is almost out, guys. Um, but what wizards do is you can actually create like a meteor, a fireball, and that'll kill them and everything. Pretty slick, guys. Uh, what the repairmen do is they just hang off your wall and they actually repair your wall for you. So that's also <clears throat> a nice feature. So we're just going to repair, 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 There we go. Next level. Um, so up there it shows you in the top left hand corner, it shows you the amount of prisoners. I only have one right now. And you just drop in that prison, prison slot. And it does take a little bit of time. Once that bar or once that circle fills up all the way, then that prisoner will officially become yours and will be held captive and you can use that against you. And once you have three prisoners saved up, you can actually press a button and put them into battle against the enemies, which is a really cool feature. That was added in version 1.3, I think. Um, so I thought that was pretty cool how you can uh, 
actually use your prisoners to help you um, fight in battle. So pretty cool. Uh, this and sort of double tap and see the number goes up and holy crap I'm gonna die. Look at all those guys. Whoa, that was crazy. Um, enemies killed. It does. Uh, we're gonna re really try around. Um, we're just gonna click fortify and then we're gonna click repair, 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 repair. So that's pretty cool. Um. So up there is the amount of enemies you've killed, 738. There's your bar over the right. Once it gets all gray, obviously you will die. And up there is the amount of prisoners you have. Right now it's one. We can click pause game right down here. Main menu, resume, or help. We'll go into the help section, and I'll read some of that. Oh, and you do pause it to you how much of the level is over. Right now it's at 4%. So it just says, like in a little intro, your kingdom is under sage by the bar... Barbarian Horde. You must spin them off at all costs and all, blah, blah, blah. So we click next screen. Just shows you what repair walls is. It fixes damage to your wall. Fortify walls allows your walls to withstand more damage, and you can build a prison in your kingdom, which you'll just drop an invader in the center of the cage to capture him. And um, click next screen. And you can purchase upgrades the bomb factory. Use captives to blow up invaders. You can shake or press the the button in the bottom right hand corner. I like the button. And you can do it. Archery range, I showed you guys what that is. Wizard school, train wizards who can cast spells to destroy invaders. You can cast meteors. And um, if you have 20 wizards, you can just double, you can just like tap on an um, enemy. And it'll actually like automatically put them in the prison. So that's pretty cool. Repair shops, train repairmen who automatically repair your castle walls. And um, that's pretty cool. And uh, they drag the fireball on the wizard to the left and release it to, la to launch a fireball attack through the air. That's pretty cool. And you can add wizards and stuff, I already said that. And um, the wooden sage engines are immune to the lifting power of your fingers, so that's why you have to release a bomb, an archer, or a wizard spell. And the horse mounted and shield carrying out, you guys saw those, the horse guys, they must be tapped once. And um, the dragons, I haven't seen any of those yet, but that sounds pretty cool. They can they can only be killed by using the wizard fire spell. Um so it's pretty. F it's a really fun game, guys. I like Stick Wars a lot. It's been one of my favorites for a while, and it's pretty addicting. And it's a heck of a lot of fun to play, guys. So be sure to check it out for only 99 cents in the App Store. I give this app a 9 out of 10 rating. Um, hope to see more uh, features and stuff in the future. They're adding a lot of cool stuff. They've been updating a lot, but I'm sure there'll be more. So I'll see you guys later with maybe an unboxing app review case review. I really don't know. But I'll see you guys soon. And I hope all of you have a wonderful day. And peace out. Happy Friday or Saturday. I don't know what day it is yet.